Engines are revving for car lovers in New York. The city's annual auto show officially opens to the public today. If you like cars, this is the place to be one of the guests on hand for the event. Ford CEO Mark Fields. I caught up with him to talk about one of their newest innovations and what it's like to lead that company. When you look at this car, it's, it's, it's unique. The only thing that looks like a Lincoln on it to me is, is the emblem. If you could tell me just one thing about this car, what would that be? There was a very important point when our team was developing this new concept. When we decided to call it the Continental, it changed everything for the designers. The reason for that is because it's such an iconic nameplate, it has such a storied heritage, that it gave them now a North Star. They knew what the heritage was, they knew the bar that had been set, and it, and it energized them wonderfully. Uh, to allow them to come up with this uh, design. And there's a mixture of emotions when you do this because you get a chance, first a lot of pride because you get to work on this iconic nameplate and then a mixture of a little bit of fear because you set that bar really high and you want, not only want to meet it, you want to over exceed it. Leadership is, is a privilege and it's not a right. I mean, you have to have an inability to accept defeat. You have to have a, a great degree of emotional resiliency. And I think as a leader, it's always so important to lead with positive leadership as opposed to negative leadership. Because even though there are challenges, you can approach that in a very negative way. And uh, the analogy I use is, do you want to be salt water to the roots or do, we be, do you want to be sunshine to the plant? Dealing with issues and dealing with them proactively, not, not, not you know, being soft on the issue, but doing it in a way that positively energizes people. And I think that's one of the key roles of being an effective leader. One of the leaders that I was most inspired by was Winston Churchill. He faced so many challenges during his life, and particularly during World War II, when he had to rally a nation against all odds and do it in a way that energized them and, and, and got them through a very difficult time. Uh, that to me was uh, very uh, impactful to me. From my standpoint, I have no regrets. I've been blessed in a lot of the, the assignments the company has given me. I've been able to have a number of different roles within our company. I've been able to live in places I never thought I would even visit. And it's an honor for me to lead this great company and our great team. Working in the auto industry is a dream job. I remember when I was six years old, my dad bought me a set of Matchbox cars. And he bought me a little case where I could put each one of them in there. And I still have that to this day. And that started my love affair with cars. So I just feel fortunate I can work in this industry and fortunate I can work at Ford. And to be able to lead Ford and lead a great team is it's beyond anything I would have ever imagined.